need bookmarks to move back and forth. Yeah. You get fancy University of Washington covers. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Juliet Bernstein, and I'm a new computer science graduate student. I'll be working in the graphics and imaging lab. Um, I just got my Kindle. I took a look at it. I spent about 20 minutes with it so far. I, I think that the e-ink technology is really great. I'm glad that that is starting to be used in devices, but um, in a way it seems it's very new technology, so it's almost like going, you know, seeing like old devices from the 80s or something where there are like clearly a lot of uh, features that have yet to be implemented. Um, I think that in 10 years we'll be looking back on these Kindles and saying, I can't believe we dragged around these big Kindles and like, uh, like you know, the graphics are so bad and the interface is so clunky, but I mean, now, now it's nice and it's, it's great to have the, the reflective surface for reading. But I, I think it'll work pretty well, and it's nice that I can sit outside and read. I really love sitting outside and reading, so that's a great feature. Um, I did have one concern about like using the Kindle for open book tests, which I talked about a little before. Um, I, when I take a test, you know, if it's an open book test, I like to, you know, have certain pages that I flip to, and I sort of memorize like where things are in relation to like images on the page, like I'm a very visual person, and with the Kindle, I can't do that. Um, uh, so I'm going to just have to like serially like go next page, next page, and it takes a while to refresh. So I did have a concern about using it for open book tests, but I think for just casual reading, um, it'll, it'll work pretty well. You know, I, I don't know about reference books, um, you know, the Kindle's clearly designed for, designed for reading novels. So you start at page one and then you go next page, next page, next page. For reference books, it seems like there isn't really like a good way to um, clearly, uh, to quickly access like indexed material. So <laughs> it's okay. Or at least if there is that feature, I haven't learned about it yet. So um, I guess there needs to be better, better features for that sort of thing. My name is Adrian Simpson, and I'm a, a new graduate student at the uh, University of Washington, Computer Science and Engineering. I um, just got my new Kindle. Um, I'm excited to start using it. I, I'm, I, I, think, I think the coolest thing about it is going to be reading, reading journal papers and things, because I'm, I'm tired of, of just having to print things out just to write on them, and also it's, it's just like physically wearing to be staring at a laptop reading papers for hours. Starting up. Do you think it's going to be useful in your courses? Yeah, I hope so. Yeah, definitely. Um, yeah, especially, especially if I'm if I'm able to, to like write on journal papers that I have, it'd be extremely useful. Yeah.